Yeah, so I think the first the first thing to to do is obviously agree with them. So agree with with what the parent is saying. So I understand, Mrs. Jones, uh, that you you guys are busy. Now let me ask you, what what days in the week would work for you? So once that parent responds with uh, set time or set day that, that they can make it then you you can then maybe look at your schedule and maybe make a compromise to say okay this is Tuesday at 5 p.m works perfect with me let's let's make that work now another way you can do it is if they can't commit every single week but they can commit to maybe uh, once every two weeks then what you can say you can say is okay, Miss Jones. I see that Tuesday at five p.m. works great with you. How about we do two hours of training so that way you're getting two weeks uh, training in advance, and then the following week, so you, we do two weeks of training, two hours, and then once we get to the third week, we do another two weeks, and that means uh, Johnny has got uh, his maximum amount of time. Uh, during the month of training cool so you're saying if someone says they're too busy and that could also apply if they live too far away mm -hmm. they could just come do two sessions in in like one day so it's more convenient for them yeah and they do that two times out of the month so they get their four sessions so they still get the same amount of sessions but they're doing it in less amount of visits right Correct. Cool. So let, let me ask you then, if let's say you drill down on the day and the time mm -hmm. with the parent and they sound like they are really committed uh, over the phone, they sound like it. And then they're like, well, you know, if we commit to this day, can we, can we change the day coming up? Like, do we have to stick with this day? to be a part of your program like how, how do you handle that with someone who is trying to ultimately they're trying to create their own schedule with you versus following your schedule yeah so that's that's a great question so the way i would approach it is when you're on the on the phone to mrs jones uh, you make it very clear that once we have agreed the set day set time uh, on this call that i can't go back and then change it so once we have our set day, set time that we've agreed both will work for us, then that can't be adjusted or changed later down the road. So that way, uh, Miss Jones knows that, okay, fine, like I have to make a commitment. And if I can't make it, make it, then it's on me because I already know that Leo or whoever the coach is, isn't able to to adjust his time or day just because something else came up. 